I am so grateful for your creativity. You know, most of the time, these shows that I do for Fringe are all about creativity. Well, everything we do is about creativity, but I try to really make a point of saying that and doing that because, um, well, we need to remind ourselves that we're creative. It's not just me up here, obviously, because you just wrote a poem. Um, and sometimes, you know, I have you up here dancing or whatever, making music. Um, because it's important for us to know that there's other parts of us that are beyond our political differences, uh, beyond our um, um, ethnic and racial differences, even beyond our any of the identities that we claim or, or put on us. That there's a something inside waiting to have a voice, waiting to express itself to the world. And through that expression, um, you change the whole vibration of the planet. That's why it's so important for you to create. It changes everything. Um, it's so important. So at the end of all of my shows, I think for the past 30, more than 30 years, it's probably, I think I started in 1990 singing this song. <coughs> At the end of every concert, I've sung it, I think. Um, and it has a special meaning to me now, because, or has a, even more of a meaning to me now, because um, I'm in this show, The Wizard of Oz, at Jiva. Some of you may have seen it already. And, um, yeah. and <laughs> <laughs> it was a very small part of it, really. But, but, the, but the cast that I'm with, I, they are so... Talent doesn't even really capture it. Because their spirit is something. It's not just their talent. It's the spirit in which their talent is given that touches me. And I know it touches the audience um, too. And I, 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 I'm so grateful to be part of that um, experience. And um, so grateful that our lion is in the audience. Uh, Paul, do you want to say hi? Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank for you. Yeah, you're an angel. So I'm going to dedicate this to this cast because they are um, just really special people. Um, this song, the reason it's my favorite song, and I sing it all the time, I guess, is well, I don't know why, I just love it, but it's maybe the most beautiful song I've ever written, but I think also it, it, there's this idea in it that there's all these differences that get tied up into one, you know, with the idea of a rainbow, and so I, I don't know, it just seems really important to make sure we understand how connected we are, even though we are individuals. It was like that thing I used to do with you guys with the hand, you know that the fingers are all separate, but actually they're kind of tied together. And if you try to do something with just one, like open a jar, you really can't. You have to put all of them there to kind of do something. So, when all the world is a hopeless jumble and the raindrops tumble all around. Heaven opens its magic lane When all the clouds talking of the sky wave There's a rainbow highway to be found Leading from your window Behind the sun, just beyond the rain. Somewhere over the rainbow, 
land that I heard of once in a lullaby somewhere over the rainbow skies of the moon and the dreams that we dare to dream Someday I wish upon a star and wake up where the clouds are far behind me. Where troubles melt like lemon drops away above the chimney tops, that's where you'll find me. So If happy little bluebirds fly beyond the rainbow, why, oh, why can't I? Thank you. Yeah.